here, nine one. So we'll get to that in a minute. But first, I would like to introduce someone who you all know and love. The reason you are all here, please welcome Doug Walker. something that's not popular or not liking something that is popular. So to start off, I always talk about a movie that everyone disagrees with me on, and I'm trying to think, it's a toss-up now. Uh, which, which one you should decide on? Uh, yeah, <laughs> a, a new one has sort of entered the ring, but it's very split. I'll just say it anyway. Uh, I really don't like Man of Steel. Oh! oh! Yeah! And like that movie sucks. This, this is the reaction that everyone's gonna give, not just for the people that are gonna see the movie, everyone is gonna do that. Oh! <laughs> but again, part of the fun is that you understand when you hear the reason, oh, like that's actually understandable, or that makes sense. <laughs> uh, the reason I didn't enjoy the movie, though I thought the action was pretty cool, uh, and I thought oh, the guy playing well. Superman was fine, uh, I thought it was trying to be something that I felt Superman was, it was trying to be very dark, but on top of that, I didn't feel it was doing it very well. It felt For a movie that was very long, it felt very rushed to me. Like, I was thinking of the first film with Brando and letting uh, his son go at the very beginning and how heartfelt it is. And here it's like, explosions and running and blood, goodbye my son, shoo, was on, what are you doing here? And to me, I could never get the emotional connection. Uh, and that was my big problem with the film, is that I felt I could never emotionally connect with the people, and just because they had the name Lois Lane or, or Clark Kent, that doesn't mean, oh, that's Lois Lane and Clark Kent. No, they, they have to have these very specific personalities that didn't connect with me. I completely agree, because Christopher Reeve will always be my Superman. No, he's, he is very right. Christopher Reeve will always be my Superman. I did not even bother seeing Superman Returns. I haven't seen Man of Steel yet, and I gotta tell you, the majority of what I'm hearing, not so good. <laughs> well, so, people, people are very split on, apparently. Yeah. Uh, so, and, and again, but again, I don't like it. If you do, great, enjoy it. Don't let anyone say you are wrong, because there is no wrong in this. <laughs> now, since I revealed one, now you have to reveal one. Okay, I already had one as soon as I found out about this panel. <laughs> oh God, here we go. 
Anybody hear of the latest Tim Burton movie, Dark Shadows? Uh, yeah. Hate me if you want, I liked it. <laughs> Heart, and that movie was full of so much corniness, it's not even funny. And I mean, I've <laughs> it's Johnny Depp, come on. <laughs> um, and not only that, but Michelle Pfeiffer and Tim Burton got to work together again. Catwoman, hello. Uh -oh. I mean, come on, that's another movie, Batman Returns. I like that movie too. I love it. Um, yeah, that's the movie that I had in mind. Uh, I to be fair, and I will say this honestly, I will always admit when I haven't seen something that, you know, I haven't seen the soap opera. Never saw the soap opera, so I don't know if it's supposed to be a certain way or not. But I actually did enjoy it very much. I thought it was visually lovely. Um, I thought... Team Four Star! I just heard you were here. <laughs> <laughs> the, movie I, the movie I like that everyone disagrees with right now is Despicable Me too, apparently. Nobody's <laughs> liking it? I enjoyed that movie. <laughs> Some people were like, no, it's dumb, it's just slapstick. <laughs> slapstick can be funny. Especially that one, because they focus on the slapstick. But my, one of my favorite movies of all time, and I'll always be fought with over it, is The Fifth Element. Yeah! It is the best Die Hard sequel ever. Curtis, Curtis, before you give the mic back, when we got into the car last night, what movie was playing? The Fifth Element. The Fifth Element was playing in our driver's car. How amazing is that? That was pretty amazing. It's one of the best scenes. The scene where the people, the police, and then the special ops keep showing up. He has to keep cramming people into different spots in his apartment that's like 10 by 10. Uh, it's an action movie, I swear. Big bada boom. My multi Anthony. What? <laughs> hey, Barbarino! Uh, I don't know. I was seeing a lot of people weren't liking Man of Steel, and I really liked it. Uh, what's 